Dr. Marjan Asefi said ever wondered how scientists detect the presence of a particular DNA sequence in a sample. The answer lies in a remarkable technique known as polymerase chain reaction, or PCR. PCR is a powerful tool in molecular biology, first developed in the 1980s, that allows for the amplification of a specific DNA segment from a complex mixture. This process has revolutionized areas of science, from forensics to archaeology and even the medical field. But how does it work? Dr. Asefi added. The PCR process unfolds in three main steps. The first step is denaturation. This entails heating the DNA sample to a high temperature, around 95 degrees Celsius, causing the double-stranded DNA to separate into two single strands. This is much like unzipping a jacket, where the zipper represents the bonds holding the two strands together. Next comes the annealing step. As the temperature drops to 55 degrees Celsius, short pieces of DNA known as primers attach themselves to the ends of the target DNA segment. Think of these primers as bookmarks that mark the beginning and end of the passage we want to copy. The final step is extension. Here, a special enzyme called TAC polymerase binds to the primers and adds nucleotides, the building blocks of DNA, along the single-stranded DNA. This happens at 72 degrees Celsius, and by the end of this step we have two complete copies of our target DNA. Now the beauty of PCR is that this process is repeated over and over, each cycle doubling the amount of target DNA, resulting in exponential amplification. Within a few hours, millions of copies of the target DNA can be produced from a single DNA molecule. In summary, PCR is a three-step process involving denaturation, annealing and extension, which allows for the exponential amplification of a specific DNA segment. This ingenious technique has become a cornerstone in many scientific fields, enabling us to detect and study specific DNA sequences in a sample with unprecedented ease and precision. So, the next time you hear about DNA testing, remember the crucial role that PCR plays in making it possible. Dr. Asefi mentioned, it's a testament to our ability to harness the intricacies of life at a molecular level for our own scientific and technological advancement.